Hello again. Today we're going to take a look at S-Shuttle. S-Shuttle is a Python program to create transparent proxies and virtual private networks over SSH tunnels. We looked at SSH tunnels and port forwarding in previous episodes and saw how dynamic SSH port forwarding creates SOX proxies client programs can use, such as the browser, to get through a firewall, for example. With a transparent proxy, on the other hand, no client configuration is necessary. Also, unlike with local and remote forwarding of individual ports, S-Shuttle can handle all traffic on all ports simultaneously. Let's start our friend Tmux and then check what the outside world thinks our IP address is. Okay. I'm using the Nix package manager to make S-Shuttle temporarily available, but S-Shuttle is also available via pip and other package managers. Use the vflag for verbose output and the hyphen r to specify the remote address. The last argument is a list of subnets to root. 0 slash 0 is shorthand for 0, .0, .0, 0.0.0.0 forward slash 0, meaning that we want to root all addresses. Checking our public IP address, we can see that it has changed and is now equal to the address of the server we connected to. Nice. Let us now close the connection with Control c and find out how to connect to a different server using a username and a private key. As with SSH, the username only needs to be specified if it's different from the logged in one. With the SSH CMD argument, we can configure the underlying SSH client to use an SSH key using the usual hyphen i argument. And just to demonstrate equivalence, I use the full side annotation instead of 0 slash 0. Checking our external IP, we can see that again it is the same as that of our SSH server. For S-Shuttle to work, you need root access on your local machine, but not on the remote machine, which is great. You also require Python to be installed on both sides. If you can meet those requirements, S-Shuttle is a fantastic alternative to port forwarding. That is all for today. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please like and subscribe and I'll see you next time. Bye bye.